Next, we go to the observed peripheral left-right storyline. So now we have the greens. It is important that what you do does not distract you. So we have our peripheral focus. <laughs> I shouldn't say focus. Our peripheral perspective. There we go. Our peripheral perspective is a very broad way of taking in life. Not to get distracted by some random focus that isn't part of your storyline. So what you're looking at here is a combination like this, the, any of these storylines. It's saying, first of all, about the environment that we're still in the busy, busy activity level being high within the environment. So the left always environmentally design um, nodal place is observed. What that means is that these are beings who are designed to be observed by others, seen, witnessed, watched. <laughs> Basically, these people are uh, much more available to be seen, potentially, as always relative to the design. I'm, I'm a two, going through a six, two phase. So obviously you cannot see me, but you can observe <laughs> that I'm, I'm, I'm talking to you and I'm playing with slides. That's my way of being observed nowadays with this uh, remote internet, satellite internet that isn't consistent. So in other words, we are people who are designed to be busy relative to your design. Not just busy observing anybody else, but being busy and being observed in the sense that these are the ones who are totally occupied in their activity and they're able to catch the attention of others. They're here to be busy. They're here to be active in their environment. So I wish we had statistics. As you know, I'm always like, oh, I wonder, I wonder, I wish we could see for sure. Like get some me, get me some details, please. The observed, I wonder if those, um, this one and that last one that we were talking about over there, I wonder if the observed are those people who are more active on social media being seen. I don't know, you know, <laughs> that might be, might be true. But that is one of the things that you're here to see. We have a left environment. If you go into a room and it makes you drowsy, it's actually a dangerous place for you. There's friction in the environment. It's not a healthy place for you to be. The environments are here to nurture your activity levels. So you'll have the right kind of mm, activity levels with the observed, with the active brain body system, it's tension in the body. So at the moment you're living in your correct environment, there's something that really incredible, something really incredible that happens because what happens is that you align yourself to what you are here for, relatively speaking. In order for us to be able to conceptualize, okay, conceptualize, first we must see correctly. And this is peripheral seeing. All of us are designed to see things in a unique way. And here in this left-right combination, you have the right seeing, right facing variable arrow, that others don't see. Because you, if you are this, you see peripherally. So you're th seeing things that others don't focus on. You've got this left active environment where you're busy and the, a peripheral vision taking it all in. So the first thing to understand about what you do is that it's important that the thing that you do doesn't distract you from taking in things peripherally, a big, broader view. So in other words, it's one of those things that happens with the observed. It's like busy hands, you know, busy, uh, keep yourself busy. It actually allows you to take in more if it's on autopilot. So automatic autopilot here, things that don't require your attention, you know, operating things, maybe it's driving, things that you do repetitively like knitting or vacuuming or whatever it is that you like to enjoy doing that you are observed doing busy fingers busy hands the repetitive things where you don't have to think too much about it because that frees your mind to be able to peripherally soak in what you're seeing so let's say as an example we have a left right and that person is starting the job 
whatever job it is. The moment you're starting that job is the moment that your awareness diminishes because your focus is being locked into the things that you have to do. You're learning a new job in your activity. It's not something where you're naturally intended to be focused on potentially. So you end up not being able to be aware of what's literally going on all around you. Unless it's, um, let's say it's something that doesn't require a lot of thought. You're a janitor, you take a, a janitor position in a new place. This is not about what you do defining you. That was the people in orange like myself. Here the green. It is being able to be freed from the conscious focus so that your, your peripheral perspective is open in a sense to everything that's all around you. Because you're naturally intended to be able to be open and peripheral as a perspective. So it's very important for these people that the work that you do is repetitive and doesn't require that you spend a lot of time giving it real attention so that your mental perspective, your mind's visual life can be free. So one of the things to grasp about what it is to be a left-right storyline is that the less distraction that you have in your work, the more exalted the potential of your awareness is. So when you find ways to do things efficiently, to work out mechanisms, you know, automations, to be able to just move through things so that you don't have to give it a lot of your attention, a lot of thought, that is going to be what is very, very, very important so that what you do does not distract you. Yet at the same time, be very clear that the activity is not what you're about. It isn't. This is not like the last variable uh, quad that we looked at. The activity simply sets up the potential for you to be able to get the resources that you need in life that you require, while at the same time being able to expand your awareness. So you need to have these things where you can have the advantage of being able to let your mind float, daydream, and move away from what it is that you're doing at the conscious level. Very, very important for these beings to allow themselves to run on autopilot in the environment so that they're witnessing peripherally.